Yo. Do you want a race? Hell no. You don't? No, neither do I. Let's just go for a coffee ride. Okay, I just got out of bed. Cannot be bothered racing today. Gonna have a cruisy day on the bike with Ryan. Wow, look at that beast. And uh, we're just gonna chill out. We're actually gonna go for coffee now. And uh, then coffee probably... Before the ride, it's almost... Don't, I don't even think you should broadcast that. Oh, the rules. I reckon it's it's a good rule. I reckon it should be brought back in. Really? That's what we used to you do. Know, the Sydney siders do it, and the Kaluzzi yeah. ride. They all need. It's to critical, man. Coffee it's before cool. the ride is. I'm bringing it back. Have you got speed hashtag code? Coffee before ride. Yeah, I think we should come up with a better hashtag. <laughs> but um. <laughs> hashtag. CB, we'll, we'll work on that. Fully caffeinated. Fully caffeinated, we'll, we'll get back yeah, to that. We'll yeah. Make some suggestions, guys. Well, well, we've got a lot of thinking to do. We've got a lot of brainstorming. We better get We'll probably work. have better thinking after a coffee. So what's the story? You carry them around everywhere. Yeah, okay, just put them in your pocket. Do you? Mate, that's just one more thing you have to carry in your pocket. Yeah, but I'm not carrying a massive um, Sony camera to the... Yeah, well, true. True. Jamie, I mean, look. We're talking about his cleat. He's got cleat covers. I don't understand carrying cleat covers around. Well, so you now get those integrated cleat covers that just kind of sit around. So it just prevents you damaging your cleat. Yeah, that's a good idea. Sunday with Maven. <laughs> so we've just arrived at the uh, Glenvale Criterium. Probably one of the nicest and most enjoyable rides I've had for a long time. Uh, you know, <laughs> just all motorway, just uh, people trying to kill us <laughs> on the hard shoulder, a few bogans, and a car. Oh, we saw some kids that tried to throw sweets at us. That was nice. Just cruising, man, not pushing hard on the pedals. It was uh, those days are the best days. We're just going to head into Glenbar Creek, watch the A grade, get some footage, basically just cruise home, have a cruisy day. They're even setting up the coffee machine for me, thanks for that. That's alright. We have it here, this is Plan B, just in case the coffee man never turns up. Yeah. It's up every week since we've had Plan B. Oh, really? Thanks, <laughs> man. Is it vegan? It could be. Don't shoot. <laughs> Stop shooting. What's your website, Michael? Don't have one. You don't have a website? No. Oh, you just got a Facebook? Yeah, uh, whatever it is, Google Plus, where I put them. Okay. And do you put them on, do you don't put them on Facebook? I put a link on Facebook. Do you? And, and Twitter. That's okay. About it. Cool. Yeah. Just for free for the club. No, oh, you're a good Every, man. Everybody has a photo. Nice. Now that I've come out to the race and I'm here watching, I'm devastated that I didn't race. But um, it's okay to just have a day off, you know, or have a just a cruisy, a cruisy day. Wake out, wake up out of bed. If you wake up and you're not feeling it, um, and you're not feeling into it, 
there's no point pushing yourself because the most important thing with all this stuff is that you have longevity in the sport and if you really push yourself and burn out uh, you uh, you'll you hang up the bike you will sell it you won't ride I mean I've consistently ridden for a year now even though I've probably reduced the volume over the last few weeks or few months um, I've still stayed on the bike and that's the most important thing so uh, don't feel bad if you want to sleep in and just chill out and not race it's uh, it's okay we have three laps to go Rachel and I are gonna do the slow mos for the finish and there's a break of five up the road here they are right, this is the bell lap now All right, this is the final corner. Looks like one of the guys has jumped. Tommy Nankervis is sprinting. Looks like he's got it. What happened, man? Yeah, he went around there. I was in third wheel. You were third wheel? And he just jumped. He was waiting for the guy on the front to go and he was like looking at what I was doing. <laughs> oh, was he? How many did you win last year? I don't know. Last it was year, a I, lot. It was a lot though. Last year I'd never finished worse than third. <laughs> <laughs> no tour of bright. Why no tour of bright? Um oh, I, had, no, no, I had a family thing on yesterday. Did you? What do you guys think? We're talking about those Q ring oval shaped uh, chain rings on the big chain ring do you wanna, have you got a cue ring yeah do you want to check it out yeah come on this side i'll, uh, I'll pull we'll have a look at this we'll have a look at this stand by do you want me to get up close so you can see it yeah that's all right all right so for those of you that don't know it's an oval shaped chain ring basically and do you want to have a sprint for? no we use the same gear what do you guys think? Have you guys got oval shaped chain rings and do you feel any difference in your power and output? Do you want to see the Maven go against the Springbok in a rotor Q ring, <coughs> normal ring, gun off? I think we'll do it. Okay. We're going to put the camera down and we're going to do it right now. No, no, no. We'll what? Really? Yeah, no, right we now. Need, we need documented evidence. Like we can't just, do, we can't do it and then you go, oh, I won. We're gonna put the camera down on one of these cars. Oh, are we? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna do it now. All right, we're gonna do probably 53, um, maybe 53, 15 or something like that. So we'll see how we go. How do you feel losing to the Maven? Yeah, I'd just like to apologize to my uh, sponsors, Rota. Um, please keep the checks coming. I, uh, I'm riding a Cinarello, as you can see. I can't afford to lose my main sponsor. That wasn't a real race, obviously. I will do better. Alright, that was Jason. Okay. I'll see you later, buddy. Good mate, thanks for that. Awesome. Welcome. See ya. See ya, mate. I'm going to call this lane Chat Lane. But uh, honestly, didn't even push on the pedals then. I think I've got 30 kilometers in the bank, and it was probably one of the most enjoyable rides I've had in a long time. This is the most important thing. Keeping that fit and healthy will uh, is what leads you into your training and allows you to go out and jump out of bed in the morning and uh, get on the bike and do some big Ks. But if you're tired, you're not going to want to go do the Ks. So 
I know this firsthand because I've struggled for the last few weeks. So uh, try it out. So I'm just going to go home now, probably have something to eat and then do some, uh, some editing. And uh, then I've got to work at 4 o'clock today till about midnight. So it uh, won't be much this afternoon, but um, this may be the end of the vlog here. I'll catch you guys tomorrow.